Hi guys, Dane here, and today I'm going to be doing my September Booktuber shoutout. So as usual, there are going to be 10 channels I'm going to be shouting out. They will all be linked below, and I'm going to go through them and just give you a little bit of info on why you should check them out. So let's get started. So first up, we have Sarah Hannett. Now, Sarah is the first of two booktubers I'm going to talk to you about here. So if you know, if you know who she is, you're probably not going to know who the other one is. And Sarah is a big Narnia fan. Uh, recently started booktube with my second recommendation, which is Megan Hannett. So the two of them are sisters. And as I said, they're actually both big Narnia fans. So we've been kind of getting to chat recently a lot because I recently read the series and did my review videos. And the two of them were coming along and, you know, sharing their thoughts. And, um, yeah, just both very positive voices to a booktube. And I like to see how the two of them interact as well. So always cool. Channel number three is Louise Hill. So Louise is a relatively new booktuber. And what I really like are her reading vlogs, which are combined reading and knitting um, vlogs. And uh, she's kind of been busy a lot with, like, her life well, recently. So I believe she's just seven. moving into a and new house. And you know, getting married and doing the all these various bits and bobs that I, uh, I don't know it adds a nice extra dimension when you're watching wait. someone's reading blog when they have an interesting life as well. But she's also just sort of really positive, really it's friendly, really chatty, and uh, yeah, definitely one I'll be watching more of in the future. Story. Number four, we have the Reading Werewolf, and so this is Daniel, and I like I've loved his channel for ages. But also, recently I did the Bookish Red Flags game, which few other people have gone on to do as well, which is cool. And it was Daniel, I think, who kind of originated that game. And I don't feel like I gave him a proper shout out in that video. So I'm going to give him one here, but also I just love shouting out Daniel, really, because he's a great channel. Like, he's just a lot of fun. He's very quirky and very humorous. Next up we have Paul Reads Books, so Paul I think is a very like, important member of the little sort of subsection of the community that I'm in at least. Uh, he recently has been doing some sort of indie reviews which is cool, I think, believe he looked at my book and Todd's and a few others. Uh, takes part in a lot of readathons, very cool with tags as well and um, yeah, he's uh, another one of those people who's just super friendly and a nice, a nice person to get to know, you know, a nice person to be friends with. Okay, then we have Bookish Islander, who is a channel I'm relatively new to, but uh, he's been super cool in doing a lot of review videos for books that I, you know, like I don't watch all review videos, but every now and then I'll come across a channel where it's just review after review or either books I've read or they're ones I want to read, and his channel is certainly one of those. And uh, also, I just think he's a cool guy and, uh, you know, he talks about some fun stuff on his channel and definitely isn't one to miss. Okay, next up we have Booktube Goddess, who I can only describe as, as fabulous if you haven't come across her channel before. Uh, it's a drag sort of themed channel, bringing together the love of drag and books. Not dragon books, drag and books. Dragon, dragon books, that'd be awesome. Uh, should do uh, Primary of the Orange Tree. <laughs> Lesbian dragons, I think, as A.G. McDonald calls it. But um, yeah, just another very interesting take on Booktube. And I think channels like this are great as well because they show how it can be an art form. I mean, this brings me on to my next channel, which is Deanie. And Deanie, I actually really like her voice. I don't know if that's a weird thing to say. But um, she's been known to do videos where she'll be playing video games and then she'll be talking about books. And the video game stuff is just in the background, which I think is a really cool combination of the two. But also recently she did a video where I think she was like reacting to her terrible 8-year-old poetry or something. Or 11-year-old poetry. And I was like, this is way better than what I was writing when I was 14, 15. <laughs> so yeah, definitely check her out. Okay, next up we have Jashana C, who you've probably heard of, to be honest. She's been around for a while now, probably around as, as, pretty much as long as my channel's been around. And I've just always enjoyed watching her because, again, she's another quite positive person, but at the same time she says it how she sees it. She does like a lot of the kind of booktube classics or the booktube staples, but equally she doesn't hesitate to go in on the ones that aren't very good. And then she reads a lot of wider stuff around that as well, particularly things like fantasy and whatnot. And so if that's your bag, definitely check out her channel. And if not, check her out anyway, just because she's, you know, lovely. And finally, we have another shout out for Joel Swagman, whose channel I just can't stop consuming. Basically, he does these um, like archive review videos because I think he used to keep a book blog before his YouTube channel. And so he's kind of re-reviewing books that he read 10 years ago that might have been popular back then that I read at the time as well. And I think that's really cool. It gives, again, a new set of different books that somebody's talking about and something that I really enjoy. And we have quite a lot of overlap between our, our reading tastes, I think, as well. And so, uh, yeah, we always tend to get a lot of banter going. 
So there we have it. Those are 10 booktubers that I would recommend you checking out this month. As always, feel free to go through the links in the description below and check them out. Hit subscribe to them if you enjoy them. Subscribe to me if you're new here. Hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments if you've got any booktube channels that I should check out. And I will see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.